Hi and welcome. Thank you for watching this video. I'm Councillor Julian Bakari, the Mayor of Strathfield. Today I'll give you a brief update on some of the highlights from the Council meeting which took place on Tuesday the 7th of May. Firstly, the Council meeting began with a minute silence as a show of solidarity with the people of Sri Lanka and the victims of terrorist violence in other parts of the world. This follows on from a meeting last month in which a minute silence was held for the victims of the Christchurch terror attack. These events serve to remind us of how valuable life is and how important it is for all of us to protect each other against those who would use radical arguments and acts in attempts to draw us apart. I'll be writing to the President of the Democratic Socialist Republic of Sri Lanka to express our community's condolences to the people of Sri Lanka. Our next discussion point at last Tuesday's meeting concerned updates made to the Stratford Community Strategic Plan. I'm pleased to say that the suggested amendments to the operational plan, budget and fees and charges, amongst others, were adopted. These changes are part of Council's constant review process, ensuring we're delivering in key areas. You can see the amended document on Council's website. On another note, following the Mayoral Minute which I moved, Council will be investigating the feasibility of installing electric vehicle charging stations in the Stratford local government area. Included in the report will be the possible locations, budget, time frames and possible parking concessions for electric vehicles. Investigating the feasibility of electric vehicles is just one of the many ways Council is acknowledging its role as we seek to alleviate pressures on the environment. We look forward to continuing the work with residents on sustainability initiatives. Finally, I'd like to thank the Cumberland RSL sub-branch and their president, Greg Reid, for including Stratford Council in their Anzac Day ceremony in April. We are honoured to be part of this important event every year and are looking at ways we can enhance the Davy Square Memorial Site to better suit the commemorative ceremonies and honour our fallen soldiers. That's about it for this month's Council meeting highlights. Thank you for watching and I'll be back for the next Council meeting update in June. See you then.